whole lot more. I, I gotta tell you, there's no, uh, no vision at all for Unicorns of Love on this bottom side of the map. So it's the Dragon for Rift Herald trade. Map and vision around mid lane, especially for a Flash Lazoli, is gonna be absolutely pivotal. Snowfire going in with the quickness, he's put to sleep and knocked what? to the side. Here's the hero's entrance, Snowfire almost dies, but gets away with the grand entrance. And now Ananasik is the target, the bullet time coming out. And first blood secured by Supermassive. And who better to pick it up than Zaitnoth? Supermassive, who looked for part of that engage. Unicorns of Love uh, weren't able to catch out the target they were looking for. But here comes Sanjay Double the TP. bottom. Whoa, that was incredibly quick. Double TP as they look for the fight. But Lulu does have Flash, he's going to chase onto Santos. Unstoppable Onslaught flashed away here by Gadget, but he's going to be slowed up by the Seismic Shard. And the chase is on, the rat is caught in the trap. Supermassive get their second. Supermassive just have the answers into the Twitch, and he's denying him even more. While Zynot was getting kills, now Gadget is dying, but hey, no man's down bot side apparently. They're ready to pick up on her turn. That's, uh, that feels more like Flash a... on Gadget, and Armut has ult, he wants to find the rat. Cow's gonna look for the smite here, and Anasik's gonna jump forward, steals it away. Snowflower going in with the quickness, can't quite get the damage down, and here's the Cyclone onto the back line. Armut is the first target, Zaynos gonna try and position across the wall, and opens up with the bullet time. Boss took a nap in the middle of it, but is still able to survive for the moment. Kakao chased off, he will get the kill on Boss, he will also fall. And meanwhile, the rest of the fight continues as Gadget has been untouched. Zaitnot's going to try and do what he can into No Man's, but it's a great fight for the Unicorns. Five kills in the river. It was just a really good fight. There. Being a massive Minotaur that is incredibly <laughs> tanky, but also breaks any CC on you at the time. So you wait for the sleep, you pop the ult, oh. take 65% damage reduction. Gadget jumped in here, but the spray and pray. Zaitnot's just going to die before he can even do anything. Snowflower was the one to engage, and now he's the one who is being collapsed on. Santos trying to give him a gift from the side of the lane. And Snowflower goes down, double kill to Gadget, that rat is so strong. Well, the CC was not there, and then he just opens up with so much damage. Look at this, 1,700 gold lead for No Man's in the mid lane. Gadget is a th And now we're at a point for Supermassive where it was dead even, you know, maybe slightly behind in gold, but now Zynok gets jumped on again. Heroes Entrance coming out, Snowflower looking for the engage once again, and No Man's has been charmed up. The Zoe goes golden. You have to feel that stopwatch isn't going to save his life for long. Shutdown goes over to Zaitnot. Santa's now forced away as well. He's going to go to sleep. The gadget opens up with a spray. Well, the press. kill does go to Supermassive, and that was a good fight for them. Even more gold being picked up by Unicorns. The game has exploded yeah, on your Galio. You're not... <laughs> well, 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 then. You don't. You're going to go for the teleport behind. Balulu looking for a flank position. The dragon's already gone. Balulu trying to catch out Gadget. Has the taunt not flashed away from. But here comes the Cyclone onto the back line, and Zaitnot's already almost dead. Snowflower uses the quickness to stop him. The Unstoppable Onslaught has popped, but that's on the tanky front line. Only Boss has fallen. Gadget killed off one. As uh, also Santos goes down right at the end of the fight. Gadget's still on the chase here, looking for Kakao. Does have the spray and Bray won't find him. Yeah, but that's where I don't think that's right. He's going to work out as well. Because it's basically like putting him in a Mordekaiser ultimate. It's like yeah. a little bit against the ropes in this game. 5,000 gold behind is super massive. Once again, Snowflower just dancing forward. The sleep has landed. X Flash from Santa's going to dive in with the Cyclone. Zeitnod is already done for. And Armut tried to get in onto the Twitch, but he was flashed away from. Boss will take the kill. Two quick ones for the Unicorns. And they turn that. And it only seems to be growing for our CIS representatives. Perhaps the bullet time into the hero's entrance. Like you have so many tools at your disposal. Snowflower slept up towards the top of it as Supermassive maybe looking for the Blast Cone play here. Snowflower forced away, there's a hero's entrance. Armut's jumping onto Gadget, he pops the stopwatch. You mentioned it ended, it's gonna keep him alive for the moment, but the knockup's still coming down. Kikau flashing forward, the shutdown goes over to Zeitnot. But now the fight turns on his head as the Unicorns of Love are the ones advancing, stepping forward into the jungle of Supermassive. The opposite end right there, and that'll take Unicorns to soul point here for that Infernal, and their comp built around Poke, it's perfect. Kakao steps in front of the battle side. I think Zainal might have just died to that. The Loating Lullaby coming out, and here's the teleport. They don't want to wake up No Man's yet. They want him in bedtime land as Santos is the one to step forward. Ananasik tries to dive onto Kakao. Zainal now the target, and he is left for dead by the rest of his team. Oh. Armut eats a spear to his rear, and he will go down as well. The Unicorns of Love have a minute left on this bound. You know, I thought the push from Unicorns was done after they got the Drake, but they took the fight there. It looked good for Supermaster for just a second. I mean, just a second, because Unicorns turned it immediately around, and now they're going to have the inhibitor. At 15 minutes, this gold lead was 1,500. 
at 26 minutes. It is a 10,000 gold lead for the Unicorns of Love, and this is what they did in the CIS. Kill, they double kill, turning it into their advantage. Now they're looking at the second inhibitor and Supermassive. When will they call the final fight? When will they draw the line? On, uh, Gadget does not have his flash. He's got about 15 seconds on that. No man stepping forward. Here's there the game. They dive onto Gadget. The hero's entrance coming out as well. He's asleep. asleep. Armored is asleep. He took a nap on the job, and it may cost Supermassive at this fight. But Lulu dived onto the back line and was able to kill off Gadget. And now it's up to Zeitnot and Armored to try and step forward. Santos goes down. 2 v Two, uh, 2v3, sorry, in favor of on him, but Unicorns, they want to end the game right here. Kakao are looking to try and get some damage down, clear out the minions, but you just can't do it quickly enough. Armor jumped on, Kakao sweeps away a few, but the Nexus Tower is the target for the Unicorns. And it looks like Supermassive may have met their match in game one here. Armor down to about a third HP, the Nexus still ticking away, but here comes Zeitnot back alive, going to be able to defend that win for the moment. The bullet time oh, coming no. out, cancelled immediately by Zeitnot, and uh, that means the Unicorns will be able to get away. Middle and the bottom lane. Inhibitor didn't fall in the top lane ender, that's important for us to note. The Unicorns went for the win instead of making sure. Has heal, has the spray and pray, there's the Inhibitor down. Santos dives forward onto Zeitnot's charm comes out, there's a hero's entrance as well, but Gadget is totally untouched in this fight, and Boss is still on the front line. Bullet time coming out, Santos is going to knock Zeitnot back into the fight. Armour tried to do what he can, but the shutdown comes down for Kakao. Boss is down, but super massive are just getting swept away by Gadget. Armour falls, a double for Ananasik. And super massive retreats to the safety of the fountain as Unicorns take game one.